Recently, I've been asked quite a bit on what the best weapons in the game are, and so today I'm going to be starting a brand new series to help show you guys what guns I would recommend. Yo, what is going on everybody? My name is Connor, but you guys can call me Superior. And today, I'm going to be bringing episode 1 of my brand new series, Top 3. And what this series is, is where I can take anything in the game like for example assault rifles which is today's episode it can be the top three assault rifles and then i'll kind of say what the top three assault rifles are in my own opinion and then kind of break them down um and everything like that so um you know next episode could be submachine guns it could be perks kill streaks whatever you guys want so right now what i need you guys to do is drop a comment down below on what the next episode of this series should be um, do you want some machine guns or perks? Just whatever, whatever you want it to be in this game, whether it be armor, literally anything. Like to the top three like boots in the game. It's up to you. Uh, whatever you want, I can do it. So drop a comment down below right now on what you want episode two to be, and then I'll go through and I'll pick my favorite, uh, and that will be episode two of the series. But like I said in this video, I'm gonna be covering all the assault rifles. So let's get right into it. Coming in at number three, my third favorite assault rifle in this game is the HBR A3 and the reason that I like this gun so much is it because it reminds me so much of the Remington um, back in Call of Duty Ghost. Now I know we don't really like to talk about Call of Duty Ghost because that wasn't everyone's favorite Call of Duty but I did enjoy the game a lot and uh, this gun really does remind me of the Remington. Great gun and also it's the best in class handling in the game of all the assault rifles so you know that really will help you out a lot in a lot of gunfights and running around the map and stuff like that. Um, so it is a really good gun. It is very very accurate like I said It is like the Remington and the Remington was notoriously known as one of like the most accurate assault rifles You know you could win a lot of like medium to long-range gunfights pretty much every time unless the person was like a phase sniper or something like that You'd pretty much uh, win any gunfight at long range So this gun is very similar. However, its fire rate really isn't the best It probably has the slowest fire rate of all the assault rifles that really is the downfall but if you get lucky and from a supply drop or something, you get one that shoots a little bit faster. This can definitely be one of the best guns in the game. Now coming in at number two, we have the AK-12. Now the AK-12 was also in Call of Duty Ghost. And it was one of my favorite guns in that game too. And I'm glad that it is even better in this game than it was back in Call of Duty Ghost. Now in this game, my favorite thing about it is the low recoil. I feel like it is pretty much just the better version of the a of the HBR. Um, you know, better fire rate, decent range, decent mobility, handling, and everything like that. And it does have the best mobility of any gun also. So, um, you know, with the great range of it and the mobility of it, you can almost use it like a submachine gun, um, but it'd be even more versatile. So if you haven't tried out this gun, I definitely recommend you try it out because it is extremely lethal, and I guarantee you will like it. Now, coming in at number one, this is a surprise to nobody, the BAL-27. Call of Duty Advanced Warfare is being called Bal of Duty Advanced Warfare because of how much this gun gets used. It is by far, in my opinion, and many other people's opinion, the best gun in the game. Now, hopefully, it is rumored that Sledgehammer is going to be putting out some patches for it because it is, like, by far the most used gun. And hopefully, if they put out a patch for it, uh, other guns like the AK-12 or HBR, maybe even some machine guns can become a little bit more uh, popular and used a little bit more by everyone in the community. But right now, the BAL is the best weapon. So if you haven't tried out the BAL, I would recommend it. As much as I hate to say and want to see more people running around with it, um, it is definitely the best assault rifle. It has the best fire rate. Um, the only thing that kind of makes that's bad about that is it makes it a little bit worse at long range. So if you're in a long range gunfight and you have a BAL and the other person has like an HBR, you're probably going to lose that gunfight. But if you run around a corner and it's just like a spray and pray match, you'll win that gunfight 10 times out of 10. And you'll even beat 99% of the submachine guns in that battle. So this gun is... Definitely the most versatile gun in the game, and it is an extremely good weapon, almost to the point where it is overpowered. So, uh, I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you guys did enjoy, subscribe for more Advanced Warfare content, and also, uh, be sure to go follow my Twitter, link will be down in the description. I'm starting to do a lot more Control Freak giveaways and everything like that over there. Also, over on my live stream, I'm going to start doing a lot more Control Freak giveaways. Link for my stream will be down in the description also. Um, I really want to get more interactive with the viewers as far as like giveaways and everything like that, so be on the lookout for a bunch of stuff like that coming in the near future. But I do hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have a fantastic day, everyone. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.